If it's breaking, join Fred Blankenship and Lori Wilson on Channel 2 Action News. Now at 6, we're speaking to the family of a man attacked with a machete. We have the latest on the investigation into his attack and how he's doing as he's being treated at Grady Memorial Hospital. Live, local, late breaking, this is Channel 2 Action News at 6 p.m. Coverage you can count on. Thanks for joining us this afternoon. I'm Richard Elliott in for Candace McCowan. We want to start with the weather. We all know it is really hot outside. This is a live look over Midtown Atlanta. It is the first official weekend of the summer and the temperatures will not disappoint. Meteorologist Ashley Kramlick live in Severe Weather Center 2. And Ashley, there is a small chance for some rain. Small, small chance, Richard, out there this afternoon and not even seeing a sprinkle on the map. Now, a little bit of a slightly better chance tomorrow. I'll take you through that in just a few minutes. But this is a live look over the top of Stone Mountain here where, where we have the sunshine and the clouds around. Check out these temperatures. 96 here in Atlanta, 97 currently in Griffin. We're at 95 in LaGrange and Edenton. It is hot. We are all in the 90s besides up in the North Georgia mountains where Blairsville right now is pushing 87. You factor in the humidity, it feels like 104 currently in Eanton. So it's one of those days where you got to take it slow if you're going to be outside. Thankfully, as that sun sets, our temperatures will drop back down into the upper 80s only by 9 o'clock. Mid 80s by 11, but tomorrow looks to be even hotter than today. We'll talk more about this heat wave coming up in just a few minutes. Developing tonight, the survivor of a machete attack at an Athens homeless shelter is off life support and improving but still in critical condition. Only on Channel 2 Action News, his family spoke one-on-one -on -one with our Courtney Francisco. She is live at Grady Memorial Hospital, and Courtney, he's making steps toward recovery. Yes, Rays reliever A.J. Minter started his rehabilitation assignment with High A Rome. He's been out dealing with hip inflammation since late May, so maybe they're starting to get healthy just at the right time, Richard. Let us hope so. Well, thank you for counting on Channel 2 Action News. Don't forget to download our free news and weather apps on your smartphones and tablets. We will see you again at 11 for WSB Tonight. Have a good evening. ABC World News Tonight is next. Tonight, record-breaking heat baking the I-95 corridor while severe weather targets the heartland. President Biden and former President Trump preparing for their debate face-off just days away. And Justin Timberlake speaks out about his arrest. 